Well, scientists say a powerful solar flare temporarily knocked out radio communications on Earth yesterday. We asked next weather meteorologist Adam Del Rosso to explain what happened and what other things we may see this weekend. It's yet another impact from this active solar cycle. This time, a strong solar flare, along with what's called a radio burst, shooting a wave of energy and radiation right at planet Earth. The strength we saw yesterday on those particular bands was almost 10,000 times the normal background that comes from the sun. Sean Dahl with the Space Weather Prediction Center in Colorado says this is the largest flare since 2017 and possibly one of the largest ever recorded. Any space weather event coming from the sun will not harm you as long as you're on the surface of our planet. There are industries that could be impacted though, like our technologies, GPS accuracy, communication issues as we experienced during the event yesterday. FAA facilities across the country reporting those issues Thursday afternoon. One employee saying they've never seen anything like it. Forecasters say this storm could also lead to the northern lights over the next several days, with even more solar storms to come. Between now and all the way up through 2025, perhaps even into the initial part of 2026, we could still have uh, pretty notable space weather activity going on if things uh, continue. Adam Del Rosso, WCCO News.